Hello, welcome to the channel. Today I was at the, uh, the flea market again, and I found a, a case of uh, these cars. I think these these all came from one uh, vendor. Um, they were a dollar a piece, and um, I figured these ones. I will open up all except for the majorette. Um, that one I'll leave in the uh, in the blister pack, but I will open up the all the others. So let's get started. It's the um, Ford stake bed. This casting's been a, around for a while. There we go. Crash Barrier Constructors. Nice movable moving parts there. You can definitely tell the, uh, the quality difference between, what was this? This is 2001. That's I've had these, I think, from the 80s. Maybe 90s these came out, I remember. But the quality was a little bit better. It's pretty cool. At least it has moving parts, though. Another very popular casting, the Peterbilt dump truck. I'm not sure how common this uh, like this color variation is. This one would have been around 2009 or no my fault uh 1999 98 around that time it's got the solid blue five spoke wheels gotta love the moving parts very cool very heavy casting Here we have the Fire Eater 2. It says removable ladder. That's, I could be wrong, but I'm not sure they're allowed to have any, any removable parts due to safety reasons anymore. So I think this this card is a little bit older than the uh, the last one we just opened. This is yeah, it's a 2006 on there. Now this is one I have this in the package, but I've never opened one of these before. comes off there. You can remove it, but not easy. There you go. There's a removable ladder. Nice tampo work. On the bottom, Fire tender and on there it says fire eater. I'm 
Now I know this is around the time that um, I'm not sure of all the, the legal stuff, but um, I think Hot Wheels started to release. I I forget what the um, the other car maker. I don't know if it was Corgi, but their their models. So this might have been not a um, an actual Hot Wheels mold. So I'm guessing it says Fire Tender on the bottom. That's why. ladder back up there gotta love removable parts moving parts now this one I'm, I'm just not going to open because I don't have any major it in the cases um, still in the blister pack I have a bunch of majorette that I play with as a kid um, this is one of their later years. It's a lot of plastic. There's no um, there's no suspension on the wheels, but it does have moving parts. That that arm will move back. That's very nice. As far as playability, Majorette was one of my favorites growing up. And then Matchbox. And I believe this was around 1997. It's part of the Big Mover series. Let's open. Some more moving parts. It's a Peterbilt, another popular casting. Seems like it's been around for a long time. That's, I have. Um, I have a collection of these um, matchbox. I have a lot of the construction vehicles, um, backhoes, cement truck. A little person driving in there. There's a nice set of uh, nice set of trucks. I hope you enjoy these um, opening videos. I really do. It's so nice to see see the colors in the real light, not behind plastic. So I hope you enjoyed the video, and I'll see you next time.